This video is brought to you by Syncly Music, a fast, easy and reliable solution to music for your videos. Link is in the description. Ah, <sighs> music, music. There's so many different options. You can just go dig online and find whatever music you want and usually it's a huge rabbit hole that takes you an hour for you to find one song and and then maybe at the end of that it's not quite how you want it to sound but that's all you're stuck with so you got to use it. Well, I may have found a solution to that. Synclymusic.com, they're the sponsor of this video today. Uh, all the links are down in the description, check them out. There is this free subscription you can use, or you can go with a premium subscription, whichever you choose. But you can get your music directly in Premiere Pro. You don't have to leave Premiere Pro for any reason. On top of that, you get to customize the music to make it sound however you like. So add drums into it, check out the synth, maybe add some vocals, or maybe just a little bit of vocals. So there's a ton of options you have with this. Let's take a look at it, but first, intro. All right, so the awesome world of Premiere Pro. <laughs> I'm such a nerd. Well, let's get started. So once you've signed up for the Syncly subscription, you can either go for the free one or the paid one, depending on what you want to do. And you've installed the plugin, you're going to find your plugin through Window, Extensions, Syncly Music. And this is the panel that you have in Premiere Pro. It's basically like a plugin. So you can see there's a bunch of different genres here and categories that you can choose from. You can just click on one and it'll start playing. And you can see you can skip along here. But one of the main things you can do actually you can turn stuff down. Let's say I don't want any drums. I can turn the drums down. Let's say I want only half bass. I don't want too much bass in there. Let's go to the melody one. Let's take that down a bit. Let's see what it does to the risers. Let's take the melody two down. You can actually just mute it completely as well. So obviously that's, that doesn't sound that great because I've just messed around it and butchered it. But if I go back here, I can just choose a different one. And if I click the button up here, you can edit these. Let's take the drums down a little bit. Let's mute the chords. One, two, we can keep the melody, that's cool. This sounds pretty cool, so... You can see there's a bunch of options here to customize what the music sounds like. And then there's, there's a bunch of other stuff here you can check out as well. So, I'm not gonna go through all of them, it would just take too long. And although the music library looks a little small at the moment, Syncly is adding a bunch of music every week from very talented composers and artists from around the world. So definitely something else to keep you excited about. There's constant updates. In addition, there's new music all the time. All right, so let's say I want to get my song. Let's customize it for a second. I'm just going to search one that I know that I want. And we're just going to play it for a second. And I'm just going to go and edit these. Let's take the vocals down. It's, I think it's a little loud for me. See what the transitions do. I like it down a bit. That sounds good. Okay, so I want to keep this. Okay, so I actually like that down.
And then you can also change the tempo. I'm going to keep it at say 100. And then once you're ready to download your track, you just click the download button over here. And you can see it's mixing it all. And once it's finished downloading, it'll save your file, save it in the same root file where you have your project, and then it'll automatically import it into your project. So if I close Syncly over here, you can see that music file is right over here. So if I just drag it down into the composition, into the timeline, in fact, you can see that it's right in here. All right, so beautiful. Now let's take a quick look and see how we're going to kind of make a cut to the music. Now I kind of rushed through this, so I'm not going to choose the exact music, but I'm going to choose something that does have some mood to it for the kind of video that I want to go for. So let's say I just want to have this a moody kind of feel for this video that I'm going to be cutting here. I'm just going to be cutting shots out of this. So let's go down here. I'm going to let's say this might be a good shot here. So let's just add a fade to this. I right click and just add a default transition. I'm gonna zoom in here. All right, so I'm gonna make a change right on the next note here. So I'm just gonna delete that and let's add, let's say this shot, let's just, for the sake of the tutorial, keep this going. Go back here. All right, I'm going to cut it there as well. And then let's grab this shot here. And it's pretty much the same process. Now you can obviously add some transitions in here. So let's add a push, I'd say. I just search push in the effects. Just drag it onto the between of the two clips here. Just going to shorten it a little bit. Right, so it needs to be much faster. Let's just drag that in there. Nice, and then you can always get an audio or sound effect here and you can just kind of sell the transition a little more. So if I just time that up right there, you can just see here. So kind of cool. And then with this, I can always just keyframe the scale here and I'll just drag it in a little bit, drag the keyframe all the way to the end of that video. That way it's not so static. And then the rest is just cutting to the music. Nice thing is with the Syncly app is you don't have to go digging around into those rabbit holes online with all those websites for music. It's literally in Premiere Pro. You don't even have to leave the program. That's the beautiful thing about this plugin. Other thing is obviously you've seen you can customize the music to make it sound exactly how you like rather than just downloading a song and being stuck with that. So I hope that quenched your music desires. Uh, a lot of great tools in this Syncly Music app. Uh, customization, you don't even have to leave Premiere Pro. That's the best thing. Oh, I don't have to go searching for music all over the place. Uh, consider subscribing, stick around for the future. I do a lot of visual effects, editing, Premiere Pro, streaming, and free downloads for you guys on my website. So stick around for that. Synclymusic.com in the description, check them out. You get one song a month for free, a free subscription or you can use a premium subscription and get unlimited downloads and new songs keep getting added every month. But yeah, until next time, remember, keep smiling, keep shooting.